Hello students, I hope you all are good and safe at your home. I know you are ready for this session. Before that, please subscribe our channel, hit the bell icon for latest updates. Students, we share our earth with animals and plants too. They are differ in size, shapes and colors. Some are very small and some are very big. They even differ due to the kind of places where they live in. Some live in jungle, some live in water. And they are living beings. They need food, they need water and shelter. They can move from one place to another place in search of food. So they are also living beings. Here we will discuss about kinds of animals. Land animals, birds, insects, water animals. Land animals further divided in wild, pet, domestic and farm animals. Come to land animals. As we are having nicknames, same way land animals are also having nicknames. We can say land animals or terrestrial animals. These animals primarily live on the ground and most of them have four legs to run, catch the food. Do you know what are wild animals? The animals that live in forest or jungle are called wild animals like lion, tiger, elephant. They are wild animals. Okay. What are pets? Some animals we can keep in her home like dog, cat. These animals we are keeping for companionship and amusement. So they are called pet animals. Some animals are domesticated by human beings. They totally depend on human for their food, water. Okay, like cow or sheep. Let's take an example of a cow. It is a domestic animal as well as a farm animal. If animals reared for a purpose, we are getting any benefit from the animals are comes in farm animals category like cow gives us milk and we are getting eggs from hen and sheep gives us wool uh, these animals are also having another name like aquatic animals what is aquatic i will tell you it is clear uh, by the name only aqua means water aqua means water man yes so water means water animals so aquatic animals the animals live in Water are called aquatic animals. Some birds can fly and some birds can't fly. Like ostrich, emu can't fly but a sparrow, parrot, these birds can fly. Very tiny animals or small animals having six legs are called insects. Generally one or two pair of wings they are having. Like ladybird, cockroach etc. Through this activity we will know about water animals and land animals. This is a activity box. What is this? Activity box. Man. Yes. In this box some pictures I kept. So what you have to do? You have to take out the picture from this box and find the correct shelter for these animals. Like if water animals uh, are here. So you fix in water animals and uh, if land animals are there then you fix in the land animals. Clear? Okay, ma'am. Uh, Aditi, start. Take out the pictures. Yes, ma'am. What is that? Fish, ma'am. Wow. So, it is a water animal? Yes, ma'am. Very good. Frog. Yeah. But you know, frog is live in water as well as on land. So, it is amphibian. What is that? Amphibian. Yeah. And this side you kept in land animal. What is that? Tiger? No, my monkey. Leopard. Monkey. Wow. Leopard. So, this is elephant. Yes, the largest land animal. And tiger. What? Tiger. Turtle. Okay. Complete, Very nice, Aditi. You have done great. Students, it's time for your homework. Now, you have to listen the sounds carefully and recognize the animals. Recognize the sound as well as animals also. Okay? And tell me your answer in the comment box. You can drop your answers in comment box. Clear? So, here will go your first voice. Second voice. Third voice.
fourth voice. Now, drop your answer in comment box and if you like the video, please share with your friends. Okay, thank you.